Hello, Nuri. Hi. Good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher. Hi. How's everything? Everything is okay. How about you? I'm okay. Thank you. Thank you for asking. I'm all right. Okay, great. How was your day today? Excuse me? How was your day today? Uh, pretty busy, teacher. Did you work? Yeah. Okay. And the beauty salon? Yes. Good. All right. Hi, Maylin. How are you? I'm fine. I'm How good. Is... All right, good. How's everything going? I'm busy in my work. You're busy? Yes, today I go to the work at the office. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. I don't think so. For me, it's more tired. And I wake up early. But where, okay, where is it that you work? Where's the office? The office is Termoncogibles. Uh, oh, it's next in to It's yes. in Marriott. But you yes. live 10 minutes away from there, no? But yes, but I need to prepare for go to uh, the office. But when I stay at home, only um, maybe sometimes it's too more 10 minutes for sleep. Oh, man. <laughs> 10 minutes. <laughs> but for me, 10 minutes is... It's, it's good. 10 minutes I 10 get, minutes. I get up at 6.30 six when I stay uh, uh, at home. When, when, when I go to the work, I get up at uh, 5.30. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's true. Because I need to go, I need to prepare my song and I llevarlo. Take him? Take him at another place. Where do you take him? To school? Uh, no. Lo cuida una señora? Okay, to a babysitter. Yes. And for me, it's más, más busy. Yeah, it's um, busier. Busier. Yes. Okay, that's true. Let me see, let me open up the platform because we're almost at the end, I think. Dun, 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 dun. David, today is the last day. Yes. But yesterday I can I can join the class. I couldn't. Because I couldn't go in the class because I work late. Okay, no, no problem. Yesterday we practiced tag questions. Thanks. Tag questions is a, a well, you, you can watch the video. The video is downloaded. Do you remember the tag questions class? Hello. Maybe give you a little review right now. Uh, okay, but yeah, well, we're still in tag questions because we have to finish the the, the platform. Yeah, the platform the exams. Ah, but I, <clears throat> but, but, I no, but I watched the video. Yes, but watch, we'll, we'll teach you. If we finish quick, we will practice this right now. It's it's not difficult. Hold on. Do you see my screen? Yes, I do. 
cool. Thank you. Hold on. Listen and practice. Use following intonation in tough questions when you're giving an opinion and want to know if the other person agrees. Intonation in tag questions. Part A. Listen and practice. Use falling intonation in tag questions when you are giving an opinion and want to know if the other person agrees. Ethnic conflict is a terrible problem, isn't it? They should make guns illegal, shouldn't they? Before we go, we want to remind you that you may play the audio programs, explanations, and videos as many times as you need to. It is always a good idea to practice with your friends. Okay, first of all, here we need to understand what is a tag question. Sonia and Francisco, do you remember what is a tag question, Nuri? Yes, it's when we, we, we are not sure about. We're not sure or we are sure. Uh-huh, or we are sure. Okay, so an, a, a tag question is two things in one. It's a statement and a short question. If the statement is affirmative, the question is negative. If the, um, if the statement is negative, the question is affirmative. Hello, Jason. Who is Jason Bautista? Remember yesterday we did the plag plagiarism? Yes. We did the reading about the teacher? Yes. We did this too, porque después empezamos a hablar de... Here, okay, this is where we are now. <clears throat> animated movies aren't just for kids anymore. Do you know what is an animated movie? Yes, it's a uh, cartoon. Mm -hmm. Okay, but Discovery maybe, Kid. Yeah, good. Remember in the nine? Well, maybe from the nineties back, animated movies were for children only. Remember. Yes. yes. The Lion King, Beauty and the Beast. Dumbo. Dumbo, Pinocchio. Now animated movies really are for adults too. The Shrek. So look, animated movies aren't just for kids anymore. Some of the most popular movies of 2010 were Toy Story 3, How to Train Your Dragon, and Despicable Me. In fact, Pixar's Toy Story 3 became the highest grossing animated movie ever made. <clears throat> animated movies are fast becoming an important force in the movie industry. Making animated movies can take much longer than making a traditional movie. This is partly because approximately seven hours are needed to render one single frame of an animated movie. In fact, some frames can take up to 39 hours to render. Toy Story took 1,084 days or nearly three years to make. Most animated movies are big name stars attached to them. The voice characters. Excuse me, Tom Hanks voiced the character of Woody in Toy Story movies. 
while Angelina Jolie was cast as the voice of Tigress in Kung Fu Panda. Using famous actors to voice animated character is meant to tempt adults into going to animated movies with their children. Studio executives know that the bigger the name, the more likely adults will tag along with their kids. To further emphasize the impact animated movies have had on the movie industry, the Academy of Motion Pictures and Science began giving out Academy Awards for Best Animated Future in 2001. The prestige winning such an important award results in more ticket sales for movie theaters and more profits for animated movie makers. So let's see. Write the words. Anita accidentally deleted an important file. So her boss wasn't prepared for an important meeting. Read the sentences and choose from the words below on the, that best defines it. Just type the words. No capital letter or period is necessary. Number one, you should keep track of your computer files. What is that? Criticism, excuse, prediction, suggestion, warning, or reaction? A suggestion. Solo tengo curiosidad. ¿Me pueden oír? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes. okay, thank you. If you do it again, you will lose your job. What is that? Prediction. Warning. It's a warning. Warning is advertencia, like, hey, be <clears throat> You're so responsible. You lose everything. Criticism. Criticism. Yeah, that sounds like criticism. What is the correct pronunciation for this word? Criticism. Criticism. Four syllables. Criticism, criticism, criticism. Now say it in three. Criticism, criticism. Now say it in two. Criticism, criticism. And now say it in one. Thanks. Criticism, criticism. Yes. It wasn't your fault. Someone else deleted the file. Excuse. You'll probably find the file in the trash on your computer. Prediction. Yeah, maybe it's a prediction. And number four, it can be an excuse or a reaction. No. Yeah, no, but I know the platform is only one possible, but really there's more. Okay, um, to prepare for a TV talk show, research has to blank to find the interesting guests, such as movie, such as movie stars and authors. To be done now. To be done? Research has to be done, exactly. Next, the selected people must? Must be ranked. Must rank, yes. Number three, the top choices. Blank contact to see if they can appear on the show. Are contacted. If some of them are available, the next people on the list. Uh, 
are invited. Are invited. All right. Must be. There you go, must be ranked. Yes, thank you. Join this sentences. Can you do number one, David? Uh, pardon, I'm, I was in it. Uh, a gaffer, Koma, who works on a movie or TV crew, Koma has to carry out the lighting uh, design period. Good. So a gaffer would be like a lutilero, pretty much. Yes. Okay, what is number two? Sonia? <clears throat> Dialogue editors are sound techniques who specialize in editing film script. Yes. Good. I'm giving you the answers because it's kind of difficult. Property master is responsible for buying props. They are handled by the actors. A property master is responsible for buying props that are handled by the actors. Number four, critics were film, write film reviews. They sometimes see more than 10 new movies a week. Critics write film reviews. I imagine that job is pretty cool. Your job is just to watch movies. Uh, there are people that is pow, pow, uh, by, uh, by sleep and test belt. Mm -hmm. I remember TSS had one here, uh, the Estrella con el Seis, but ese hombre no sabía nada de películas. Yes, a bolt, a bolt yeah. of man. Uh -huh. Yes, I remember he said, Esta gran película con este gran actorazo, uno de los mejores de la historia, Jean Claude Van Damme, la película Bloodsport. Okay, there's a difference that between if the movie is good and if the actor is good. <laughs> because Jean Claude Van Damme is not a good actor, but he makes good movies. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Number five, executive producers aren't involved in shooting the film. They're responsible for the budget. Executive, executive producers who are responsible for the budget aren't involved in a big film, in shooting a film. Me no mal hice copy paste.
I don't know why it's wrong. Le estoy, le estoy dando copy paste de su propia respuesta. Ustedes le salió mal a esta. Uh, I didn't finish uh, yet. There is another one too. There is another one too. Más atrás, más antes, perdón. Okay, let me check. But you are copy, yeah, you are copy, copy the copy. number yes. four. Uh -huh. Okay, look. A property master. Okay, I don't know what was wrong. And we finished. So class, I want to practice, I want to practice tag questions. The question is, do you want to practice tag questions? Yes. Yeah, because you see, I have seven people and only one person is responding. Yes, teacher. All right, cool. Do you see my note, my notepad? Oh, only yeah. your browser. Okay. Do you see it now? Yes. You are. What is the negative? Aren't you? No, no, the negative is you're not. These are affirmative uh, statements, affirmative and negative statements. Okay. It's not tag. No, no, wait, hold on. First, we have to we have to understand what is a statement. You are, you okay. are not. Correct? Okay. Man, I really hate this. You are is affirmative. You are a doctor, you are a teacher. You are not is negative. You're not a doctor, you're not a teacher, correct? Yes. What is an affirmative question? Are you? Uh, mi teclado, mi teclado está en español y estoy tan acostumbrado al inglés. Are you? What is the negative question? Aren't you? Aren't you? You see? Man. Sorry. <laughs> Ok. Necesito saber si realmente me escuchan. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Ok. Solo voy a. Ok. So, a tag question. Thank you. 
Attack question is an affirmation and a question. What is an affirmation? There's two types of affirmation, a negative and a positive. Correct? Yes. Yeah. Right. So attack question is facile. If you start negative, finish positive. If you start positive, finish negative. For example, What is what is the affirmation here? You're a teacher. You are a teacher. Are a teacher. Good, and the affirmation is positive. <laughs> so then the question is negative. 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 Can you change this? Can you make a positive and fit um, a negative affirmation and finish positive? Yes. <clears throat> yes. How? Do it. Uh, you aren't a teacher. You are. Comma. You are. You aren't. Uh huh. Are you? Are you? Are you? Are you? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Not aren't you a teacher? No. You aren't a teacher. No. You aren't a teacher. You are. Ahora, estas son de las pocas cosas que uno las tiene que decir con estilo. ¿Se acuerdan que ayer les expliqué que esto básicamente es como decir, vea, va? Yes. Y vos sos profesor, va. Hey, hey, you're a teacher, aren't you? You, you say it with a... Oye, que, que, oye en qué aburrido se ve si uno dice así. You are a teacher, aren't you? No, you know. Um, yo, yo tengo, saben que he dado clases como por 20 años. Y a mí siempre me hacen tag questions. Quizás porque mi apellido no es muy común y se le queda a la gente. Mi apellido es Paltrons. Y le he dado clases a tanta, tanta gente que a veces cuando digo, oh, Paltrons. Paltrons, Paltrons, Paltrons. Usted es profesor de inglés, ¿verdad? Cuando alguien me dice eso, that, that's my ex-student. But it's very, very difficult for me to remember who. Because in 20 years, you know, so in, in that situation, maybe I, like, one time I went to Simán and I was doing my, my Simán card. Sí, claro, claro. Su nombre, uh, David Baltron. David Baltron. David Baltron. David Baltron. Usted es profesor de inglés, ¿verdad? Yes. Dios mío. And then, la reacción, ¿verdad? Porque tengo unas 40 libras de más. <laughs> Esa es la reacción de. Hey. Ahí empieza. Hey, you were my teacher. Oh, really? When? No se acuerda de mí. No. ¿Hace cuánto de clase? Hace como, no sé, 15 años. Como, no, I don't remember you. Y lo peor que quizás tenía nueve años, hace 15 años. You know, I don't remember. Mm -hmm. Pero en esa situación en inglés, it would be like this. I go to Simon. The lady asks me, what is your name? And I say, David Baltrons. And she says, Baltrons, Baltrons. You are an English teacher, aren't you? Yes, I am. Hi, David, remember me? <laughs> I don't know. Yes, you were my teacher. Oh, yes, I remember you. 
you know, and then the conversation starts. And teacher, and you, you, I'm sorry. No, no, I'm you sorry. You can in, do the. Go ahead. Sorry. No, go ahead. Sorry. No, in, in the same situation of, of, of one of your students, you can have, you can make the, the attack question to them or uh, you were my, my student, are you? I'm, I'm asking. Yes, definitely. Definitely. But, but in this case, this lady from Siman, she started affirmative because she was sure or she was positive it was me. Estaba, estaba bastante segura, pero no totalmente. Entonces, por eso empezó afirmativo. Si no estaba tan, tan segura. No, no, no creo que sea él. Pero aquí está el profesor de inglés. You're not an English teacher, are you? No, 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 I'm not. That's the situation. That, that's how you, um, that's how you use tag questions. Let me see. Imagine, hey, le voy a contar una, a, real, a, a true story. It happened to me in Miami. I was, this was maybe 20 years ago, maybe. I was with my mother in the airport. Yes. And I see this man very, very tall in the airport. Very tall and very, very white. Very white. And he had long hair and red. Very, very like big red hair. And he had tattoos. So I look. Who, who, who can you imagine it was? Um. Oh, this man was very muscular. He was the undertaker. Really? In Miami? Really? Yes, <laughs> in the airport. No, but I look at him, but it was... But I was not sure, but I was, but he had a cap. But he was very tall, very white, red hair, long. I'm saying, man, that's the Undertaker. Mom, mom, que? That's the Undertaker. Quien es el luchador? Uh, I'm going to ask him. No, my mom, no, 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 no. He's an actor. Yeah, you know. No, and I went and I went to him and I was very nervous. And I and I say, um, sorry, you are the undertaker, aren't you? Y la decepción más grande de mi vida. ¿Saben qué me dijo? I'm a double. No, he said, yes, I am, my friend. How are you? Me dio la mano. You're the Undertaker. Yes, man. I mean, so where are you going? Oh, to El Salvador. Oh, El Salvador, man. It's hot. Tropical wet. Me salió tan buena onda, man. Y yo esperaba ver lo que... Oh, oh, yes. Ruth. Yes, With you the, know, like, the white eyes. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, so he autographed my, my, my hat. He was a very, very nice person. Wow, Pero, lucky you, teacher. Yeah, man. I, 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 I was very lucky. The, the, the famous person I I, I met in, a, in an airport was Adal Ramones oh, <laughs> when he him? was on fire. I, I, I was going my first trip to USA and actually I, I see it in the at the airport. <laughs> but in the airport here in El Salvador? In El Salvador. Oh yeah. Was he a nice person? Yes, he, he, he out of, I, I have a, my, my notebook and he, uh, I'll go, I'll go oh, you know, you know who I met one time. This was funny. Um, when the day I got married, that day was the telethon. Ese fin de semana, telethon en El Salvador. This was, I think, ten years ago. So, 
um, my family came from the United States and my family, they were staying in the hotel. ¿Cuál es esta Puerto de Futura? In, in... Crown. Crown Plaza. Crown Plaza, right? Mm -hmm. So my family was there. So the day I got married, in the morning, I went to visit them. And, and there were many, many people there, but you know, so um, that day I saw many people in, in the lobby, totally. But the funny thing was when I was waiting, when I was waiting, I was with my brother and then the elevator opens, bing. And um, Maribel Guardia was coming out. Oh. And, um, yeah, and she, she's very, she's very pretty. But she's okay. Was in TV, she's beautiful. She looks it's gorgeous in TV. It's like <laughs> she's she's sexy. In in real person, it's like when you see a, a elegant woman in La Gran Vía. But she she was very pretty. And I was waiting for the. Uh, she was alone. So when the elevator opened, she was coming out. Iba a desayunar ella. I said, hi, um, you are Maribel Guardia, aren't you? Si, que tal, como, que tal, como estas? Oh, hi. And we took pictures. And I remember I told her, sabe que hoy me caso. Oh, felicidades. Que, que bien, me alegro. Por... Pero si usted me dice que no, no me caso. <laughs> and she laughed. She said, no, no, cásese, <laughs> me. cásese, me. Por favor. Go, okay, okay. Siempre veo a mi esposa. Por esa mujer estamos casados, mira. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I met her she was she was a nice person have you met any anyone famous teacher yes i meet um i met i met uh, about 35 years ago mm -hmm. at the bookies oh really Antonia. Wow. Yes. The, 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 the bookie bookies? Yes, I took some picture. Oh, really? Within, Where? In a hotel. I I work in a hotel. Um, it was the same a hotel, Sheraton, uh, before. Oh, okay. After oh, okay. called it Sheraton. Yes, they always change names in that hotel. Oh, really? Nice. Were they nice people? Yes, uh, so kind. Hey, that's good. Yeah, and, and very, very handsome. Oh, okay. You know, yeah. my, my ex-boss, he, um, he was a manager in, uh, in the one that's in front of Metro is Intercontinental, right? Yes. Do you know that when Guns N' Roses came, Guns N' Roses? Yes. Yes, in Clore Black Stadium. Yes. They no, no, uh, no, they played in um in in the Cuscatlan. Estadio Cuscatlan. Cuscatlan. Uh -huh. Aerosmith played in it. But when Guns N' Roses came, I didn't know that Axel Rose, he was in El Salvador maybe for seven days. Before. Yes. Uh -huh. Really? But yes, wow. but, and, and and the reason why is because um my ex-boss, he was the um, manager of the hotel in that time. But he said that Axel Rose, he he was he wanted complete silence. Ni salía del cuarto. He rented two rooms. I don't. He said I don't know. He was. He wanted. He was. He didn't go out. Like he never went out. He was only in the room. And he wanted Sapporo beer. He, and he told me in in the in the hotel no vendíamos eso. So he had to go to like Super Selectos in Santa Elena personally to go buy him la, la cerveza Sapporo, right? But he told me that one time Axel Rose decided to come out, and he went to the lobby. And in the lobby there was a wedding, a party, a wedding. And there was music, live music. So, Cumbione. Yeah, so maybe he's, hey, cool. 
So he went and throw. <laughs> you know, like, and then when people recognize me, oh my God, Axel, you know, it's, and he's, oh no, so, so he, he went back. Yeah. Wow, cool story. <laughs> oh man, you live with me, Posa. Imagine in our wedding, llega Axel, give it a head to me. Axel, Axel, what? Please kiss my wife, kiss my wife. <laughs> <laughs> And take a picture, porque si le digo, kiss me, I was, he punched me. <laughs> y mi esposa, en serio, yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> there's a um, there's a video I have of of you too. Do you know you too? Yes. It's a uh, Irish band. Yes. So he was singing the song, with or without you. And he uh -huh. gets this girl. And he sings to her, and when the song finishes, he kisses her like. Y, y la, y el que la recibe el esposo, like yes. <laughs> That's a good story. O sea que si un día yo conozco a Scarlett Johansson, no le diría a ella que me besara. No. Be. <laughs> no. 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 So, um, but imagine Axel Rose was there like for for eight days before the concert. Well, like rest, maybe. Yes, maybe like they say, no, we need to rest. Okay. Uh -huh. So, but the, the thing is that people ask him, um, uh, you know, you are Axel Rose, aren't you? But remember, esas son de las pocas cosas que sí necesitan, necesitan personaje para, para hacerlas. Porque no puedo decir, Nuri, usted está casada, ¿verdad? O oh, pero, oh, Nuri, usted está casada o no? I don't know, pero it sounds like a robot. You need to say, hey, you are married, aren't you? For example, listen, oh, man. I need, I need help. I need a teacher. I need a, hey, Kalena Kalena is a teacher, isn't she? Yes, she is. Okay, I'm going to ask Canela for help. I need a teacher for children. Yes? Okay, David, can you ask somebody? So let's use third person. Third person. Uh, Let me give you an example. Um, Naibu Kele is the president, isn't he? Yes, mm -hmm. he is. Uh, is Nuri a, a beauty? No. 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 You're starting with a question. You always start with a statement. And if, ah, yes, I, yes, yes. Here, let me change affirmation. I'm going to put statement. Nuri is a uh, beauty stylish. Isn't she? Isn't she? But I need I need more more um intonation. I don't know. Yes. Mm -hmm. Isn't she? <laughs> Isn't she? Yeah, very good. Like Isn't she? a Nuri. Uh, a, pero otra vez recuerden esto es una pregunta. O sea, no están. 100% seguros, por eso es que una pregunta es porque nunca, si estuvieran seguros nos preguntaran, ya yes, hay que tener claro eso, pero a veces qué tan seguros están de la pregunta, de eso depende si van a empezar afirmativo o negativo, ya yes. por ejemplo okay. aquí David, good, porque Nuri ya nos había contado más o menos lo que ya hace, entonces, hey Nuri es a um, She's a, what is your profession, Nuri? Uh, um, stylist. Stylist. Nuri is a stylist, isn't she? Like, remember, remember Quijano, Norman Quijano? Yes. He's a dentist, isn't he? Yes, it is. Yes, yes he is. Yes, he is. Yes, yes, he is. Yes, he I sale, sale la asamblea de la, la, ¿cómo se llama? 
la de Centroamérica, ¿qué es lo que le está? Parlacen. El Parlacen, ahí sale. Ahí sale, dice que da la cara por el país. <laughs> It's funny. All right, yes, like, hey, por ejemplo, hay gente que quizá no sabe eso, pero porque doctor, doctor Norman Quijo, he is a doctor, uh, he is a dentist, isn't he? Yes, he is. Okay, but David, don't ask me, ask somebody. Uh, any, any example? Mm -hmm. uh, YouTube is a uh, Irish band, uh, R and J. But who are you asking? Uh, Rafael, my name. Yes, they are. Uh -huh. Yes, they are. Awesome, very good. <laughs> Rafael, ask somebody, please. <laughs> Uh, Nuri, Najib Bukele isn't a good president, is he? <laughs> for, for me, he is a good president. Okay, now remember, this can be a conversation. Because Rafael said, y puede pasar, you know, people, maybe people in the United States, um, maybe you say, hey, Naibukel is not a good president, is he? Por lo que vende en la, pre <laughs> en la prensa o el diario de hoy. You know, and, and Nuri says, well, you know, maybe, I don't know, for me, for me, he is good. Or she can say, no, he's not, he's terrible. Yes, very good. So that's where the conversation comes. All right, go, Nuri. Okay. Rafael. Uh, you work in a airport, aren't you? Don't you? Don't you, excuse me. I'm, I'm working worse, sorry, Nuri. In an airport? Ah, I'm sorry. Uh, no, I don't, Nuri. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry, Rafael, can you ask Sonia, please? Hi, Sonia. Hi, Rafael. Um, yeah, so, Sonia, you are, uh, you are a mom, aren't you? No, I am not. Okay. I think, wait, let me see if I remember. Sonia, you are, don't tell me, don't tell me. Sonia, okay. you are you are a computer engineer, aren't you? A system engineer? Yes, I am. Are you? Okay, good. I remember that you told me something at the beginning of the class. Yes, I say you. Yes, but in the moment you're not working, right? For the moment. No, I'm not working. Oh, okay. Good, but I remember that. I remember that you said something about computers. You see, this is a perfect case. I wasn't very sure what she does, but I remember she mentioned something about computers. All right. Okay, class, look, today we're going to do um, a little conversation. This conversation is about habits. Do you know what is a habit? It's a notion yes. that you practice frequently. Yes. What is the difference between a habit and a custom? Uh, 
Um, I don't know. For me, ha uh, habit is is something that you are uh, creating, and you you put a a little effort to to do. Okay. Yes, a custom is something more in a group. A custom, it can be in your country, in your family, in your school, in your religion. In El Salvador, it's a custom that we listen to cumbias in Christmas. We eat chicken sandwiches in Christmas. It's a custom, correct? Yes. Yes. Um, in school, it's a custom that every Friday or every, every, I don't know. Do you have a special custom in your school? Do you remember? Yes. Um, game, Amigo Secreto. Okay, secret friend. And um, in, in church, in your religions, it's a custom to go in white and black or, I don't know, it depends on your religion, right? It's a custom to, to get married and the woman in white and the man in black. That's a custom. When it's a habit, it's something you do personally. Okay, now everybody, we have good habits and we have bad habits. Yes, I want you to tell me what is one good habit you have. But please don't say I brush my teeth. <laughs> no, that's good. I mean, that's good. But tell me a good habit that you have so we can start a conversation. For example, I'm going to tell you. One good habit that I have is I like to read. In fact, I, I am reading this book in this moment, which is not very good, but I'm going to finish because I like to read. Imagine you are drinking coffee, estang en una cita with a man or a girl, and you say, so, hi, so tell me about yourself. What do you like? And the person says, Oh, I like to read. What questions would you ask? Which book are you reading? Very good. Uh -huh. you, you say like, oh, really? You like to read? Uh, what do you read? Yes. So ask me. Okay. Uh, how, many, how many books uh, did you read? When, when I was a kid or, or what? And, and you like? How many books remember? have you read? Uh -huh. Repeat. How many books have you read? Good. Um, I, I don't know. To be honest, I don't know. Maybe 100. I love and you like to read a, a specific genre or, or do you like everything kind of literature? Hey, good like, question, good question. Um, I like to read, I like to do, I like to read biographies about controversial people. Okay. I like history. It's a good habit you have, teacher. Yeah. yeah. You. And now Would that you we, like I'm sorry? <laughs> Do you like uh, romantic? No. Nah. No. Mm -mm. Okay. No, I don't like romantic novels. That to read, no. Do well, you like to read uh, books in English or in Spanish? <laughs> mostly, mostly the majority in English. Okay. But look, this is my favorite, my favorite book, and this is my favorite person. Don Quixote. Yes. 
Okay. I love this is this is my favorite thing. Let me go. I tell my wife, si me muero hoy, please ponga my Don Quijote with me. Eh, y por eso lo tengo aquí en mi, en, en mi cuarto de estudio, porque tendría que estar en la sala, pero mi hijo empieza. Na, 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 na. No, don't touch. Don't touch my Don Quijote. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. I think, I think, yeah, that, that's my favorite book, Don Quixote, because ha, have you read Don Quixote? Yes, I remember it when I was in, in high school. Yeah, I love, I love, I love the fact that he's so crazy. <laughs> and you say, when you, man, just stay local and you read Don Quixote. No, I, I am normal. <laughs> yeah. It's All nice. right. Get um, right to, to mm -hmm. that the, your your son is five years you say but five yes. years old or, mm -hmm. or he's five to, he's five oh yes um he I I do that I do that with him every night I sit down with him and I read him a book okay. but every time I, I I read the same book in a different story so I start inventing stories <laughs> but I want him to uh, see me reading <laughs> yes. You know, um, one book I recommend, I recommend you to read, it's a very popular book, Se llama Alquimista, from Paulo Coelho. You say the, the, the last one, oh, yeah. one from, about Paulo Coelho, yes. My, my yeah. wife has a book of Paulo Coelho, I don't know what it is. What it is but. but Paulo Coelho is a little like, um, I don't know if I said last time, but he's a little like Mana in music. Yeah. Okay, Maná, they make good songs, pero todas son en igual. <laughs> so if you read Paulo Coelho, one book, two books, three books, I think, oh, man, it's, it's good, but it's the same, it's lo mismo, lo mismo. But I recommend you only read El Alquimista, and si pueden leer ese okay. libro, lo terminan, y a uno les interesa la literatura, leernos lo suyo. Hmm. Because it's a very good book. It's like, oh, it's like, wow, it's, it's a very good book. It's like, it's like you don't stop reading. Like, eh. I remember, lo leía y solo sentía, hijo, ya solo quedan como cinco páginas y yo no quería que terminara. Like, eh. oh man, how is this going to finish? And when it finish, when it finish, you say like, what? I want more, I want more, I want more. And then you buy more books of Paulo Coelho, and that's how you start to read. Yes. What about you, Rafael? What is one good habit that you have? Uh, well, I think I I try to do exercise, not not running a kilometer or something, but uh, at least 20, 30 minutes. I like to do some push-ups and and some exercise indoor. Indoor. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was going to yeah. ask you that. Where where do you do the exercise in your house? Yeah, in my house. Oh, okay. So you like to do like um, cardio? Yes, like like cardio and actually I'm not super super um, <laughs> uh, sporty, but I I, I mostly in the, in the pandemic like I I, I started to to, oh, that's to do it. You have a, this habit, this habit. No, that's a very good habit. What about you, Nuri? Do you have um, a good habit? Well, maybe I drink, uh, I used to drink uh, hot tea um, because I think that it's healthy. A okay. chamomile tea, a ginger tea. Okay. Um, sometimes green tea. I think it's better than coffee. Wait, but you used to or you still do? I still do. Oh, okay, that's good. Right now I have here uh, chamomile tea. Chamomile? Yes. Am I pronouncing it correctly? Chamomile? Excuse me? Chamomile? Chamomile. No, you said, what is the name of that tea? Chamomai. 
I don't know. You said I am drinking a tea, but what chamo might I no even con que es de manzanilla. Okay, porque hoy chamo mai. Chamo mai. De verdad, yo eso oí. Sí, but um, it's, it is how the pronunciation is chamomile or is chamomile teacher? I don't know. That that's what I'm asking. I, I never heard that before. <laughs> it's manzanilla. Chamomile. Oh chamomile. 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 Oh, okay. Ah, okay. Chamomile. All right. Oh, okay. Chamomile. Oh, cool. What about you, David? What's your good habit? I like to watch documentals. Oh yeah, cool. Uh -huh. Hey, have you seen that documental on Netflix about that that man in Tinder? Ah uh, no, but it's a tendency in, in social networks. Yeah, I watched it. It was it was okay, but man, there are some stupid. I'm sorry, but there are some very women that are very stupid yes. it, it, it's, it's, I'm, not, I'm not saying women in general I mean I can't believe yes. I can't believe that <laughs> yeah there are people there and I prefer to watch uh, documentals about uh, history for example yes. uh, how to start Coca-Cola and, and their uh, competencia with Pepsi Something oh, yeah. like that. All right. uh -huh. Talking about that, did you see the movie about McDonald's? Yes. It was good. Huh? Yes, it's good. It's good because, because uh, you can uh, realize there mm -hmm. are people uh, opportunists. Yes. Uh huh. And they 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 see opportunities when when the other people uh, don't see. Yes, that's true, that's true. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Okay, class, I have to leave you, I have to let you go. It was nice to meet you. I, maybe I will see you again. Nice to meet you too. Yes. Okay, teacher. All right. Nice. Remember, nice the, best, meet you. the best way to practice English is practicing it. Lo que le dije al principio una vez. Eh, hay una diferencia estudiarlo y aprenderlo y aprendiendo solo se aprende en práctica yeah, yeah it's like um, I don't recommend you to study English I, I recommend you to learn English and when you learn it's like when you drive when you drive if you can't drive you're never going to drive reading a book okay so you put here you put here no you're going to drive practicing Mm -hmm. You have to to swim. You know, you're not you don't study to swim. You you learn to swim. You don't study to speak. You learn to speak. All right. So you have to practice, practice. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Have good a night. Bye. good night. Bye. Have a great weekend. Thank, Thank you. you too. Bye bye. Yeah. Yeah.